Beloved people of God, our hymn focus for today is for the beauty of the earth with the tune Nori Kong. Whatever is right, whatever is pure, whatever is lovely, whatever is admirable, if anything is excellent or praiseworthy, think about such things. Philippians chapter 4, verse 8. One of the delights that adults have in being around children is to hear their sequels of pleasure as they observe and discover some ordinary objects about them. No doubt our Heavenly Father is also pleased when His children take time to observe and appreciate His creation and then to simply express joyous gratitude to them for His countless blessings. Today's hymn reminds us of the common blessing of life that many of us often take for granted. The beauties of nature are parents, family, friends, and the church. The lyrics then direct our grateful praise to God himself, who is the giver of every good and perfect gift. Not much is known about Folloitis, Sanford, Pierpoint. Author of this lovely text, he was born in the intriguing old town of Bath, England. Even today, Bath is most interesting and loving, nestled in the hills surrounding the Haitian city. Here one can still view the large pools of natural mineral bath for which the town was named. The inspiration for this in text is said to have come to this young author as he was strolling about his native town one day in the late spring. Entranced by the beautiful countryside with the winding Avon River, in the distance. His heart, no doubt, swelled up within him as he enjoyed the beauties of God's creation. The sun, the flowers, the shining stars. Pierpoint also recalled his social blessings, friends and home, those relationships that bring such enriching dimensions to our lives. Above all, however, where the spiritual blessings as represented by the church, God's chosen agency for accomplishing his divine purposes in the world. Each of these blessings is then directed to God with a hymn of grateful praise. People of God, God has made everything beautiful in its time. As we sing this hymn, let us appreciate our maker who has made everything in its time. God bless you as we sing this in, and I wish you all a blessed week ahead. God bless you.